Hello and welcome back to another episode of SD Gundam G Generation Cross Arrays. I need to figure out a shorter version of this. <laughs> but then let's just call them G Gen Cross Arrays or something. I don't know. Uh, also, I uh, before I start this uh, chapter, I really wanted to uh, uh, ask for your help uh, because I am still fidgeting with the sound level of it. I'm not sure if the the music level and also the dialogue levels inside the game and also my own voice is is uh, is balanced enough that you can hear me clearly or you can still enjoy the gameplay as well. So, but let me know in the comments if you have any suggestions. Maybe uh, the music should be louder. The, uh, you should be louder, or uh, you should be <laughs> you should not talk or something. Yeah, feel free to leave a comment. Yeah, I I read them. I I promise. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so before we jump into the second um, chapter. All right, so you can see here stage two. Last time we completed stage one. Uh, so we, to add this, this uh, episode, we are going to move on to stage two. But before that, we are going to do some management. <laughs> yeah, they will not be boring. I promise you that. Yeah, I... All right, so you can see here, uh, this is the form group uh, organization part of the game uh, where you can uh, uh, manage your own groups of troops. Uh, you can see here, all these uh, characters are actually original characters from, from the G-Generation series. They do not appear in any of the uh, anim series that are uh, like the Gun Wing or, or so on. They, they don't appear in those uh, animations. Uh, you can see here, so we have a, a battleship <laughs> or warship as they call it and then with the warships they they, they can uh, usually carry uh, one team only but then uh, later battleships uh, or better ones actually have can carry teams of two and uh, yeah before I started the first series I actually go ahead and just bought a a battleship that allows me to bring two teams simply because I needed the warship to be there and that uh, if we use the carry base uh, which I can show you right now I believe yeah if we use the carry base here you can see that this is grayed out the second uh, group is grayed out you, you can't deploy the second team I think there are some uh, spare parts that you can install onto the carry base uh, that can unlock the second team however uh, we don't have it right now so we are not going to use it uh this uh guyana okay whatever uh this battleship is uh not the best uh, it's just so so but uh, it's pretty expensive however uh, but it is worth the price because we can bring uh, a team of two. Uh, uh, no, no, no. Uh, bring two teams uh, of four uh, mobile suits, so it is very good. Uh, we can deploy more suits uh, when when we are in the in the stages and then also things like that. So yeah, uh, and also you can see here as we progress and uh, kill enemies units. Uh, they have uh, on the lower left side of the screen you can see there is the EXP whenever you continue to uh, gain experience uh, there are two things so the first thing is if you continue to gain experience with the uh, mobility suits uh, they can become more uh, higher in attack uh, higher defense high mobility but the movement does not change but uh, the fighting prowess so to speak uh, for the mobility suit will increase across uh, across time when you gain more experience and also once you reach like say here level 5 or level 6 uh, you, you can instead of um, improving the stats of the original uh, suit that this one is the Phoenix Zero one instead you can uh, quote unquote develop uh, as the wording they call it develop them into another uh, mobility suit which is even more powerful than than the ones that you have usually they are more powerful than uh, than the ones that you have right now so uh, you can see here if they reach uh, level 5 you can develop it into a Phoenix Gundam 
Uh, we, of course we have it, but uh, once we reach level 6, these are some of the things that I don't know what they are. <laughs> like right now, I don't know what they are, but uh, yeah, we'll soon find out once we reach level 6 with the mobility suits. So yeah, uh, I hope they gain more experience. <laughs> I, I need them to gain experience and develop. <laughs> Alright, so here is another group that I have set up. Uh, in between episodes, uh, in preparations for this feature. I don't know whether I should call it a feature or not. Uh, so here, instead of the story mode, we also have the group dispatch. And group dispatch is basically, I would call it a uh, mobile games uh, feature. I don't know why they do this, but whatever. <laughs> yeah, so how this works is that you, there is a dispatch time for it. So this is the dispatch time of five hours. So you put in a a group dispatch, uh, a dispatch group. Uh, you set it like this, and then you uh, once you commence dispatch, the timer will count down. And once the timer finishes, uh, it, the timer will still count down even if you close the game. So it's like five hours later, uh, you come back and reopen the game. Uh, the the dispatch will be completed, and then you'll gain experience, you'll gain uh, spare parts, you'll gain all sorts of good things as well. Uh, so, which is, uh, uh, I hate this kind of gameplay, but this is what they decided to do, so, yeah, I suppose. Well, the, the good thing is that if there are some characters that you are not very, uh, that are not very favorite for you, then you can just send them on this patch and then they still gain experience and then you don't have to play with them. <laughs> I suppose that's the, that, that's the quote unquote good part of it. But uh, other than that, yeah. So, because I've already set up the team of uh, space, uh, space available, yeah, so you can see here. Uh, space available, uh, mobility suits, uh, the turning capability space is B, some of them are C or something, which is not as good, but eh, whatever, yeah, <laughs> you just give it a try. Now, if you commence the dispatch, uh, you will lock in the group, and you won't be able to use that group to, uh, for the dispatch group, yeah, dispatching a group will delete, uh, okay. That's a very strange word. Yeah, once you lock that group into dispatch, you won't be able to use it in your stages, other stages in the story mode. So you should look out for it. The maximum number of groups you can dispatch is free. However, I'm not going to do it all just yet because uh, there are some of the dispatch that they, they you can see here. They recommend uh, characters with strate uh, strategist ability. And then there is also some that is a uh, character with elegant or charismatic ability. Once you have those characters and uh, you complete those recommended uh, points, then you get uh, better results and then you get better rewards. So, uh, and those uh, character abilities, the charismatic abilities, and also the strategic uh, strategic ability, I think we can get it in stage two. So we are going to do it. Uh, in very short moments. However, allow me to introduce another of the uh, features before we jump into the game. Uh, this is the quest, but instead of quests, they actually are just uh, achievements. <laughs> yeah, so you can see here once you uh, achieve certain stuff, like um, you can see here completion reward hero Yui, so you can uh, use your capital to hire him as permanently, I think, as your uh, pilot. So the completion condition is max out the get gauge of hero's unit, so which is gonna wing, obviously. So yeah, uh, you once you get that uh, gonna wing, you also get the pilot as well, which is fun. And then there are also some that are more interesting. You can see here, uh, operation day break, um, hero. Defeats uh, Noventa with the Bean Saber. So in the next stage, I I would be mindful that uh, Hero needs to kill someone with a Bean Saber. And then once we did that, we have a Bronze Rank modification. Uh, they are basically the spare parts that I mentioned. Uh, 
so it's a random uh, part that they are going to give you. So yeah, <laughs> but whatever. Uh, so once you continue to complete them and play through the game, you are most likely to get most of the achievements. Uh, not all, not all. Sometimes you can see here. Uh, destroy at least 25 popular dolls within 4 turns, then with Wolf Air, defeat Torres or something, yeah. I mean, these are something that you have to be mindful when you are in the game. However, I don't think you need to pay too much attention to it. <laughs> yeah, alright. With that out of the way, let's jump in. No, no more talk. We want to see gameplay. Alright, so you can see here, um, if you defeat uh, this uh, Noventa, uh, ma uh, Field Marshal Noventa, then you get the Charisma ability. And uh, also, you have also the Strategist ability as well. So, these are the uh, character ability that you want before you go with the Dispatch as well. Atmospheric and Ground, so there is no space uh, uh, stage just yet, which is fine. Alright, let's go. ガンダムの出現後、コロニーの意思を確かめるべく宇宙へと上がったドリアン外務次官。ああ、ドリアンはそれを確認するために、ああ、ドリアンはそれを確認するために、ああ、ドリアンはそれを確認するために、ああ、
あ,あそうだ何もわからないまま死ぬのは嫌だったでも今は違うあなたが戦う気持ちがわかる<笑>私も今ヒーローと戦っているリリーナの瞳に映る決意の色それは己の正しさを知る者が持つ戦う意志そのものだった Yeah, so originally, Hero Yui is、uh, planning to kill、uh, Lilina, but. Alright, ah! c a t u l u and、uh, Entourage! <laughs> The Mechanic、uh, Corporation. It's like brand new! They're pretty much the same make. Yeah, so. The Gundam design is basically the same.、Uh, while they, they are specialized in different ways, you can see here、uh, Gundam Sandrock, obviously, for、uh, close combat, while、uh, Heavy Arms is for、uh, fire support. <laughs> It's like I'm seeing double, right? Boss? Ah, r a s i d o True, which is what has Master、uh, Katuru so worried. We did l a o t o I wouldn't want an enemy of guys who can fight like he does. I'm in your doubt. Can't say I expected that. Well, you're free to go. But do you mind telling me your name? I'm c a t a l u l a Baba w i n e r I've got no use for names, but I suppose Toloha will do. Call me Toloha b a r t o n Alright, so. Again,、uh, Tolawa p a t u n is not the real name of,、uh, of this pilot.、Uh, Tolawa p a t u n is actually the previous pilot for Heavy Arms, but in an accident,、uh, the, uh, the pilot, was,、uh, which is a mean guy,、uh, was killed by some mechanic, if I remember correctly. So that's,、uh, this, this part is revealed in the NS Wars a n i m e So, yeah, and then、uh, this man just came in and then he wanted to pilot、uh, the Gundam. So he can, he then adopted the code name、uh, Toroha b a t u n and then just、uh, take up on heavy arms and go to Earth. Thank you, Toroha. Let's do this again. Let's do what again? <laughs> Assuming we are both alive, we most likely will. Master! <laughs> Katolu, you are just letting him go? Knowing our location, it'll be fine. Not exactly the chatty type, is he? <laughs> Shikashi! <laughs> What if he comes after us? He's more than welcome to try. It'll be a chance to see him again. Alright. Yeah, in a way,、uh, Katolu is. A rich old prince of some kind that <laughs> gets put on a gun for some reason. So, there's a whole lot of、uh, <laughs> Leos <laughs> that we can shoot down. Leo Edward Space. Okay. The shuttles have arrived, Your Excellency. Added to our ground forces, the numbers will be on our side. Ah, Lady a n I miss you. <laughs> Understood, fine work. I've also taken the liberty of increasing the number of reports stating that OEC's upper echelon will be、uh, gathering at the new Edward Space. You and I will be there. That much is true. <laughs> You'll be using yourself as a lure, Your Excellency. And thus, the people can give themselves freely to history! Now then, let us see what happens. It shall go according to your will, Your Excellency. <laughs> It all rests on the Alliance. It's up to history to prove whether we were right or not. Yeah, so t o r e s u k i Surinada is、uh, planning something. That's for sure. They want to lure the Gundam out. 
the alliance was formed to keep the world's military powers in check. That being said, haven't we become a military power ourselves? All of this work developing new weapons, and for what? Is this the path we are supposed to take? So, you're suggesting a reduction? Only to start, our end goal should be complete and total disarmament. And what of these most recent incidents? Attacks from mobilizers made from Gundam alloy, an alloy only manufactured in space. Such power only serves to put the Earth in danger. Why not ask someone who's fought them? Torres! I believe the colonists are engaged in sub <laughs> subversive activities. Indeed they are! <laughs> Isn't that a round of applause? Okay. Your Excellency. Say to yourself, my lady. We don't need actors within the Alliance. Actors, Your Excellency. People to speak the Alliance, alliance true intent. I want the colonists to know that we understand their suspicions. And to allay their fears, we must open a dialogue with them immediately. Yeah, so Noventa was actually the one that is championing the uh, a peaceful path, uh, a dialogue with the space colony organizations. But <laughs> but what about the mobilizers? They will see no point in destruction once they realize we want peace. Let us talk. We might even find a road we have missed. Of course, history is heading down the wrong path. Alright then. No, we'll need our last actor in pace. Oh my god! Enemies attack! Oh, Nikki! They're attacking the base! Banda! Alright. Alright, no. Wait, what? No, no, no. <laughs> no, that's not gonna work. <laughs> ah. Cannon folder. So they say. Ah, oh, Wing Gundam, yay! New Earth Space! That's where the OEZ is entering! Oh! We also can uh, see <laughs> Dill Maxwell with his Gundam again. Uh, this is the first time, right? Yeah. Yo! Hey, you remember my name! <laughs> and I'm trying not to bungle this one, alright? It's your funeral! Well, I can tell this is gonna be a hard one. I don't think you get it. This is a critical mission. <laughs> I totally get it! Now's our chance to make OEC back for mercy! <laughs> it's not like before. We are cutting the head off the snake. Alright, ah, then we can get off this planet. Oh boy, yeah, easy! Again, cannon folders. <laughs> They're not <laughs> solution <laughs> that defensive line. <laughs> right, fun. There are way more of them than I expected. No falling back this time. Oh. Is it all five of the guns now? Yeah, heavy arms is going to show up. Yeah. Aren't those OEC's new models? Then why are they attacking the Alliance? <laughs> ah, Cartula La Barbarina! Oh, come on, them again? <laughs> hey, Toroa! Good to see you again! Is it just me, or do those two machines look like just like ours? Don't tell me they are. I can do this alone. <laughs> well, it's okay, nah, eh? The strength in numbers, right? Ah, uh, Sana. 
I will fight anyone who gets in my way. Hey, now what's all this? Hey, those two suits look like ours. Okay, lady, our actors are ready. Let us raise the curtains. Yes, Your Excellency. Yeah, one for dramatic, right? Hail those Gundam pilots! Tell them we want peace with the colonies. Not before we get you out of here, Marshal. Shikazi! <laughs> if you still want to negotiate for peace, sir, we can't lose you in this fight. Well, now, <laughs> I'll forgive. I see, I don't plan to die in vain for the sake of the negotiations. Then, please use my shuttle, sir. It's ready for emergency launch. The thing you'll be so accommodating. I am with the Alliance, Marshal. That you are. Of course, sir. Tolaes! Where is my shuttle? By this way, General Septum. What? Why? I thought separate sufferers are safer bet. <laughs> I have my own uh, personal shuttle, in fact. A bit cramped, but the latest specialist model. Is that right? Then I suppose I'll come with you. Follow me! Now remember, uh, General uh, Septum is the one that is uh, kind of warmongering, so to speak, uh, and it aligns with uh, Torres' uh, agenda better than uh, Field Marshal Noventer because Noventer keeps uh, uh, seeking peace path for them, and uh, so OEC cannot have uh, a strong influence uh, among the alliance. However, once with Noventer gone, uh, uh, the the OEC uh, so basically Torres Casurinada can uh, gain control of the alliance uh, because uh, they they will have a fight uh, in their hands and they want the best uh, military organizations. <laughs> Noventer is an unfortunate coincidence. What better to do than uh, to fly out in a shuttle? When you are under enemy attack, right? <laughs> this must be very safe. Oliver! Shuttle! Oh, you see, Brass thinks they can run off in the shuttle, eh? Not on my watch! I'm finishing them! Oh, we directly go to the sortie team as well. Okay, alright. I'm not. Yeah, so in. Oh no. Okay. Yeah. Uh. So you basically can, uh, come up with two teams to. Yeah, to do the stage. However, I only have one. So yeah, whatever. It's okay. Destroy Novander's shuttle. Can hero destroy Novander's shuttle? All right. So this is not a timed event. I don't think. I would certainly hope not. I would certainly hope not. Yeah, uh, but I have my doubts. I have my doubts. Yeah, I should have. Uh, right. I wonder if I have made it the wrong call. I should. Uh, I should put the battleship down here. So better to help uh, Hero Yui uh, get through these. Uh, MS and reach the shuttle instead of yeah. If the shuttle is going to go away, then we are going to lose the battle. But eh, all right. Uh, all right. You both are in my way, so. <laughs> やはり俺には戦場という部隊が一番似合っている。Ouch! Took a bit of damage. I hope it's not a big deal. Alright, let's go! Yeah, cut them same rock. Sandaloku! Okay! (laughs) 
Boom. Right. Okay, alright, now. Uh, right, let's see. Let's go, alright. Let's go this way then. Alright, the first time it is attacking. Yeah. That's a lot of damage. I don't think you can hit him. Alright. Perfect. Still damage. <laughs> Good fun. And uh yeah. Bim Saber. Let's go. Ah, how can I cack me? I so sure. Alright. Perfect. Target no get your cocky. Sigi no point to him. Ah, the shifting, huh? Love it. Oh my god, I I don't realize how much I missed this. Uh Alright, let's see if I can uh do some of the Alright. Look at the Nishka to uh what's wrong over now. Gonna work. Oh, it actually hit. <laughs> I thought it was not gonna hit, but okay, four thousand damage. Perfect. Yeah, now it is wood. Then I can. Um, I can send out my own suits to. Oh. Oh. Uh, no worries. We have like twenty thousand HP, right? <laughs> I don't worry about it. Alright, then we can send out to uh, finish the job and... Uh... Uh... Alright, let's do this. Can we kill him? Uh... I have my doubts. Let's just... Shooting weapons instead. Yeah, I used to be my bow. Yeah, this should finish the job, right? Come on, come on, hit, 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 hit. Perfect. Yeah, now. The, the important part is this is that you have to wound some of the mobility suits first. Uh, wound some of the enemies first, so that when you send out your mobility suits, uh, they can start killing stuff, and then they gain the yeah, and then they gain some bonus uh, attacking steps. Right, so chance to step, but do not move on to attack just yet. Instead, we should send out more troops, and then we start to. Do it like this. 
So now you can see here, our Tornado Gundam is also ready for action. So you can see here, by using uh, a lot of the supporting attacks and also to wound one of the targets and then and then to ensure that they can continue to uh, have extra bonus steps, uh, you, you can basically obliterate a lot of uh, your enemies in a single turn. Bam, bam, and bam. Yep, so you can see here our full team. Uh, well, basically, one more, need one more. <laughs> All right, I am not sure if I can actually get support now. Yeah, so I need to be within the. Okay, so what happens before? Uh, you can see here, uh, this is our leader. Uh, within the leader circle, all the units can uh, use support, uh, attack support and defense support uh, with each other. However, once you leave the commanding uh, circle, uh, you can't use that. So we have to be mindful of that. Uh, let's move this way. Is that enough? I'm afraid not. Let's do it this way. Make sure it is secure. Alright. Bam. Yeah, this is going to kill it. Yep, 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 yep. Can we move down to help hero? That is the question. I want hero to just you know, like just go all the way in and then just chop it up and then reach the shuttle. But I don't think he himself is uh, enough to take down the shuttle himself. Alright. Okay. Right. Now, ah, uh, yeah, there is another thing. So you can see here, uh, you have team one and then you have team two, but also you have the master. The master is basically the leader of both teams. Uh, instead of him uh, directing the attack, uh, anyone who is in both of the teams, no matter which team they are, uh, if they are within the the master's uh, basically commanding square. Uh, they can also help uh, attacks as well. So it's kind of like this. So you can see here we can send a turner and a shell as well to to help with the attack. So yeah, uh, they're going to oh, evade that. Huh? All right. Let's hope it hits. Okay. Yeah. That's a kill. A little bit wasteful on the EN, uh, but it is what it is, I suppose. Uh, we're not going to send more. Uh, doesn't seem to be uh, to be useful in a way. However, Hero is by himself here, and that is not something I want to have. Plus the rival is 2 to 5. Well, but it's not going to be one shot, one kill, right? Now, instead of uh, can't, wait, no. Yeah, they're not. They're not evading. That tells me uh, it's not a one shot, one kill. Alright, let's take a look first. Yeah, 2 to 4, that's why we face. Alright. Are they on the same team? I don't think so. No, they're not. 
Uh, in that case, well, let's do it this way. Alright, I'll have to know how much the, twin, uh, the Buster Rifle is going to do. Okay. 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 That's a lot of damage. Boom. Okay, it's gonna hit. Oh, no, 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 Boom. Perfect. <laughs> I'm denying the XP for the <laughs> uh, for the story characters. Oh my god, I, I shouldn't be doing that. But all right, can you reach him? No, you cannot. All right, yeah, <laughs> that's a mistake on my part. But okay, all right. Now, look. That the master doesn't listen to anyone else. So basically, you, you can't command your master to help you attack. However, we can do this. We have our own. own team where we can attack. But yeah, one of the limiting factors for. For this game, it's actually the EM from the from the suits because they don't regenerate itself. So, oh god, we are one step away from returning to <laughs> returning to the warship. All right, all right, all right. Oh god, take EM. Huh? Yeah, so it run out of energy. It has to return to the uh, to the warship for refueling. Well. Come to think of that, let's just let's just do this then. Yeah. Running out of fuel, that's that's ridiculous. Uh, if I remember correctly, actually the the master uh, is going to um, regenerate EN uh, each turn, so that is less of a problem for him. But uh, <laughs> for the others, it's a bit. Of, Problematic. All right, yeah. All right, we'll end this first. All right, let's see if I can counter it. No, evade or try to. Anyway, yeah, bad placement on my part, actually. Uh, Once we keep uh, counter-attacking like that, uh, we will be able to go up to um, supercharge uh, and super high or something. And then, once you start to critically hit others, it will be <laughs> it will be fun. It will be fun. Ouch! I still think we should be mindful that we need to kill stuff. So our energy level is a little bit low. Ouch! But 2,700. Huh? That was a hefty attack. A chunk of HP gone. Yep, that's exactly what we are looking for. Uh, Okay, don't tell me the shuttle is gonna move, okay? Alright. Destroy all enemy units. Destroy no vendor shuttle can hero destroy no vendor shuttle. Alright. Alright, I'll go ahead and use the Steam Sif. Alright, alright. No, this one. Yeah, the 
signature attack. Yeah, the color there. That's it, huh? Alright. Woo! Gandam in order to you, Iniwa. Karukua Nainda. Okay. So that, oh, I won't. Alright. They can't support each other, right? Yeah, they can. Yeah, they're not of the same team. Yeah, that's... <laughs> if they're on the same team, they can do some really ridiculous business. Like, uh, hero attacking and then have uh, Duel Maxwell just uh, supporting and then Duel Maxwell attacking and then have hero supporting. <laughs> yeah, it would be ridiculous, but... Uh, I suppose not. That would be too overpowered. <laughs> and also, yeah, the Phoenix Gundam, my uh, master in the in this warship is uh, regenerating EN as we speak as well. So yeah, that's so that's always fun. All right, let's wound you without actually killing you, and then we can move in to finish the job, I think. Bam! Right. Mind you, this is on normal level, so uh, the game is balanced around this. Once you reach like uh, some very ridiculous level of uh, like uh, the heart and then the extra mode, I don't know. I mean, I haven't tried them. I don't intend to try them right away because there simply is no point. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hero. How many energy are you going to have? Seventy-nine. Well, that's a lot. Okay. Can we do this? Maybe. Alright, I have the option to move hero further because we move here, we kill this. Yeah, I think I, I'll do that. Yeah. So now he can actually reach the shuttle very quickly. Okay. Yeah, we're not going to attack the shuttle just. Yes, I think? No? No. Yeah. We need to use the... Remember, um, there is a condition where Novanta has to die by hero's uh, beam saber. So, don't attack it just yet. <laughs> not, not just yet. Not just yet. However, we should make sure... That Dual Maxwell is also advancing nicely. Okay, morale up. Uh, how about this? Butch. All right. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Uh, All right, send someone to Yeah, we send someone to hurt it so that we can All right, defend, okay Is that enough? Uh, 
Uh, that's very weird. Okay. Oh my god, this is another part of uh, the game that I love uh, with Cross Ray. Uh, not so much in Genesis, because uh, there are a lot of cutscenes for the characters. For the beloved characters. Uh, that doesn't happen in uh, back when they are doing the two generation Genesis, and uh, I really hate them for it because it just didn't feel very good. I think that there are people who think that they are a little bit overdone uh, in a way, but I mean, it's a lot of fun <laughs> watching them just whacking their swords and. Uh, also come out to say some words as well, so yeah. If you do not uh, enjoy it, you might find it a nuisance, but why would you? <laughs> Basically, why would you? <laughs> oh. A hit, yes. Perfect. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna do the same. Are we gonna do the same? Uh, I don't know. Huh. Now, all right. The problem is, is the shuttle going to run away? That's the, that's the important part. I see no indication that it's going to do that, but I was a little nervous. Fingers crossed it won't, or oh, I'll be having a bad time. I don't want to redo this scenario again. <laughs> that's stupid. Let's continue our killing, shall we? <laughs> Let's go! Bam! Yeah, they don't stand a chance. Yeah, no matter what you do, they are going to die in two hits, so... If you get to do that, it's pretty awesome. Uh, but you're not reaching anyone, so okay. But in that case, um... Uh, no support, huh? uh, I figured as much. Yeah, the, our character is still very early in the game. Uh, they're like level... level 1? Level 2? Or oh, level 4? Yeah, the command stats is not going to... Uh, basically, all of their stats are not very good, so we just have to live with that for a while, uh, hoping that with the increase in level comes uh, more powerful characters, and uh, yeah, so basically that's it. Yeah, I find it a little bit awkward because back in the older games, uh, when you leave the uh, battleship too far away, you get significant uh, penalty to your hit rate and your dodge rate as well. However, right now it doesn't do that. Uh, instead, they just. I think uh, the only thing that is disadvantageous is that you can't ask your uh, your battleship to support, uh, give you support fire, which is basically the same as the attack support with uh, different team members as well. Uh, I don't know if I like that change, but okay, I suppose. <laughs> Alright, yeah, let's just kill them. No reason not to, I mean. Boom. Alright. Always push uh, for attack. Other stats can be. Uh, complemented by the pilot's ability because they can how well they dodge things or uh, uh, receive damage or 
how easy they are to hit stuff uh, based on the uh, pilot's uh, stats. But the attack stats is uh, very unique in that you, you kill stuff faster and then you also later stage you have ridiculous HP uh, stuff so you, you want to kill them as fast as you can so yeah <laughs> all right anything else that we need to do I don't think so all right let's go all right uh, are we really gonna do that okay ouch <laughs> no not good we don't want to lose uh, if we lose the um, battleship, we are going to lose the game, so we should try not to do that. Yeah, counter-attack uh, whenever we can. Make sure that enough of the enemies are being wounded at least, if not outright killed. Okay. Another gone. Yeah, the death ship is very good at dodging attacks. It's like what? Um, all right, let's see. All right. Yeah, it's pretty overpowered. Oh no! All right, anyway. <laughs> Running all over. Energy, that's that's a problem. <laughs> what what does that <laughs> What is that? Okay. Wait. Can we actually counterattack? Yeah, we can. Ouch. Counter. Super vertical. Does it kill it? No? God damn it. Uh All right. I need hero to get back to uh What? It resets them into normal. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Okay. It's fine. Everything is fine. We can do this. Uh Yeah, this doesn't kill it. Uh, wait. All right, let's see. Can hero destroy no Ventus shuttle? It has to be a beam saber attack. Yeah. So basically, uh, why do you? Why did the game want you to do that? The reason is, uh, they want you to reenact the scene where. Hero just uh, pulls out a beam saber and cuts the shuttle in two. I'm afraid it is actually an event, so instead of uh, wounding it with our uh, heavy arms right here with a with like a uh, machine cannon shot, uh, instead I'll just go ahead and do it with uh, the beam saber. If it doesn't kill, uh, no harm, no foul. We can do it next turn. Uh, maybe not. Okay, alright, 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 alright. Well, in the meantime... Uh, in the meantime, actually, we should defend our <laughs> battleship. <laughs> uh, bad times if we actually lost it. What the hell? It doesn't kill it. Okay. Ugh. All right, shoot it down, please. That was a little ridiculous. All right. We level up. Yeah. Good. Character level up. Love to see it. All right. I don't know why they do away with the battle map 
Yeah, they, you, you don't have any options to list out the, the battle map. I'm not sure if you can actually do it in a, with a keyboard and mouse setting, but yeah, this seems a little strange to me. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, Alright, let's do it this way then. Oh, okay. Oh, you guys are not gonna have a good time. Now, I think it is actually a, um, a game balance thing that they did there. Like, um, when you are supercharged, uh, if you actually get hit, you lose the you lose your uh, uh, concentration and lose all the MP and just goes back to half MP uh, status. Uh, <laughs> yep. Okay. All right. We're just fine. It's a mild inconvenience, I suppose. Yep. Send Rob kill this. Okay, also, I wanted to prevent our the aliens to continue going after our our warship, so we should send out some, just in case they wanted to tangle with us for some reason. Uh, alright. Yeah, there is no, there are no enemies right there. Can we do this? Oh, but we can. Oh, but we can. Urgh. Critical. Pierce. Oh, ho, 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 ho. there's a lot of damage. Well, can you attack? 16. All right. One more attack then. All right. All right. All right. Alright, wow, okay, a lot of level ups, perfect! Uh, alright, try to return to the, <laughs> to the home base, I suppose. Uh, anything else I should be doing? I don't think so, yeah. Just get back to the ship. Evade! Uh, counter attack. Uh, not enough to kill it, of course, but... Alright, evade, perfect. <clears throat> so it's, it's, it's actually much more important. Oh no, it actually hit. <laughs> they, they actually connect. Yeah, it's more important to have a high dodge rate than... than the... Um, then uh, high defense stats, uh, simply because of this setting. Yeah, actually, most of the Gundam games, uh, dodging attacks is actually the the most important part of the game. Instead of like uh, you're trying to kill each other uh, as quickly as possible, it's basically the theme of it. All right. Alright, clean up. Well, not clean up. I'm afraid if I clean up, the, the shuttle is going to run away, so... Well, let's, you know, let's do this first. Ah! Oh. No? Maybe not. <laughs> okay. I hate you, game. 
Yeah, I, I think the shuttle also regenerated some HP, so that's that's why it doesn't kill it. Uh, I suppose that's okay. One of the systems that we haven't been using is the skill system where uh, people that are in the battle group uh, have different skills like this, uh, attack burst, uh, damage dealt, plus 10% for units within the selected area so we can activate it and then uh, within the commanding area there uh, they can give like skill boost, uh, XP boost or, or some of the defensive boost as well but right now we don't need it so uh, yeah, we really don't need to do it right now, so that's why I didn't use it. Uh, there are like one use, one use per uh, per fight, so no, <laughs> we're not going to waste it. Ouch. Okay. Ah. Yeah. Oh. yeah. <laughs> it's gonna kill it. Good, 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 good. Alright, don't run away, please. Shuttle, don't run away. Don't run away. Don't run away. Alright, don't run away. Okay, thank you for your cooperation. Hero, please. Spin Saber, cut it to pieces. Oh. <laughs> no banter. Uh, don't be rash now, young yeah, man! Yeah, uh, actually this is uh, the irony, is that uh, the the, co the space colony actually wants peace, but because of the uh, oppression by the OEZ and also the Earth alliances, uh, they have to resort to violence, uh, create Gundams to attack them, to make them listen. And uh, however, uh, with this act, uh, Hero Yui actually cuts off all possible uh, dialogue options uh, for the Earth alliance and the space colony. So yeah, it becomes a very prolonged war where Torres uh, Kasurinada is going to ascend from his position and uh, there is a lot of people dying, so eh? Enemy reinforcements have arrived! Maybe. <laughs> What happened? The field marshal! It's a declaration of war from the colonists! After we wanted to talk peace with them! The field marshal was central to the talks and now he's gone. Now notice, the field marshal who wants talk is gone. And also, uh, the, uh, the diplomat, uh, Dorian, is also assassinated. Assassinated by Lady Anne as well. So you can see here, it's actually the OEC that arranges all the things to escalate the war. Such a bare-faced act of aggression! We'll never give in to the colonists! We'll fight them to the nail! Yes sir! <laughs> well done, General! But we'll no longer be needing you! What? A splendid performance! A pity you had to exit the stage! <laughs> Nani? Your Excellency mustn't leave any blood in his wake. And now, the second act. We'll be busy. How shall we handle the Gundams at the base? I leave that to your discretion, my lady. Yes, Your Excellency! Uh, right. <laughs> Colonel, requesting permission to head to New Everest. Permission? No need for that! Ma'am? You need only activate the missile self-destruct sequence. Destroy the missiles? You can manage that remotely, yes? Yes, ma'am! Then move! Yes, ma'am! <laughs> it would have never been this simple with the old alliance. The Gundams are finished now! Yeah, so they wanted to 
uh, detonate all the new Edward's uh, warheads to destroy the Gundams in, in his wake. I think. Ah, uh, crap. Ugh. Just keep on coming, don't they? Good. I won't rest until they are all gone. Until the entire OEC is gone! Yamlo! Makaino! Can't you see there's no point? And I'm a Gundam! So, that makes five. Don't you get it? You wandered straight into OEC's trap! What did you say? You fools just wiped out the Alliance Peace Action! This was all part of OEC's plans! You are just puppets, and Torres is a Kickstarter, is pulling the strings! Nani! You're telling us Torres has been messing us around this whole time! We, he got us! <laughs> then we need to catch him! We can still make it! Don't be stupid! The original plan was find about finding an opening! The enemies got the advantage now! You're right! Oh fun! Where's the round? <laughs> Crap! <laughs> Crap, yeah! Crap! I know, just keep coming after us! I think they might be trying to surround us! Well, I'm still fighting OEZ! I don't care if I have to do it alone! Gundam Pilot! Can you hear me? Ah, Sally! Ah, I've missed you. A woman! Hiro Yui, are you listening? <laughs> the base is undergoing a self-destruct sequence. The OEC is going to blow up the whole base just to take you out. You have five turns until it explodes. Ah, uh, yeah. What? Come on, just one thing after the other. Got it. There are multiple missiles installed around the base. And when they go off, they'll vaporize everything. Alright. We just don't have the time. Not enough to cover the whole distance. Holy crap. I need you to destroy those missiles in time. I know it's hard to believe, but I believe in you. I know I'm asking a lot, but please stop the explosion. All right. One, two, three, four, five. Oh crap! That's ten of them. Missile location is confirmed. Ah uh, well, I guess <laughs> we're doing this. You fail or you die. Well, I'm not dying here. Location is confirmed. <laughs> Destroy it now. This is too easy. <laughs> what? What? Which part of it is easy? <laughs> Interesting. I'll get them all myself. Uh, no, you're not. Five turns. All right. Because we are. Uh... Yeah, we activated the secret element as well. Okay. Okay. Uh, that's a lot of HP for those missiles. I I'm ex I, I'm actually expecting this, but. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Let's take a look. I'm actually slightly worried. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, this could get ugly. Actually, five turns, uh, you say. And then we also have to confront these forces as well. I wonder if the Gundam Force is, uh, yeah, the, the five Gundam is enough to destroy all the missiles. It should be. Should not be that that difficult. But they, yeah, the problem is they don't attack. So you have to actually go in, attack them, instead of waiting for them to attack you and then you counter attack on them. 
which is the main source of uh, yeah of damage that you're going to do. All right, I'm actually going to transform. Yeah, that way he flies, but can he reach it? This is done deliberately, right? Like one tile away from that. Oh god. <laughs> So only the heavy arms is going to hit it. Uh, alright, 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 alright. Um, okay, so we're going to do it a little bit backwards. And by backwards, I mean... Oh, and we should be mindful too, if the missiles explode, uh, some of the damage will be done to the surroundings as well, so we cannot use like melee attacks to destroy them. I do not think. Yeah, we should be mindful of that possibility as well. Not that it's uh, an absolute sure, but... Alright. Wow, alright, critical. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. How about this? Alright, 5,000. Uh, Alright. Other alien forces is going uh, going to uh, confront us. I would be hoping they do, but... I can't decide. Uh, yeah, we we basically wanted to bonus step, bonus step, bonus step, bonus step, bonus step, and then just kill all of them uh, very quickly. But I'm not sure if that actually is the right move. Uh, all right, four thousand. Well, in that case... Oh, I, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Oh. Alright. My best shooting pilot. Uh, give you a roll, I guess. Boom. Is that a kill? Excellent. Alright. Now, with that move, I actually allowed uh, the, uh, the leader to come out, start shooting, and with that support, it should one-shot this. Yeah, and also, I noticed the missile doesn't explode, so we can destroy it uh, as we see fit, without the... Uh, uh, without worrying about uh, getting getting this uh, getting into the explosion. All right, the fuel beam cannon. Yeah, just maximum maximum damage. Just go for it. I don't care. Are we gonna kill it? No. Bad. <laughs> so it's gonna fly. It's gonna fly. Uh, all right, let's see about that. Wound it, enough? Is it enough to kill it? No, not enough. However, because of that, we can do this. Yeah. All right. Do we want to do that? We want to move forward, not backward. So, yeah. Well, in that case, the full Gundam team, aside from the heavy arms, can go all the way downwards to make sure that they can finish the uh, the lower side of the map. I think. Are they gonna catch up? Is the problem. 
I don't think so. Yeah. Well, in that case, I think we should just continue to move uh, this way. So make sure that they can uh, go down or up. Yeah, if we have another team of uh, battleship down here, it would be a lot easier. But can we attack it? We can. Oh, but we can. Oh. All right. So another thing is that you really wanted your team leader to be able to. Uh, to move as well because uh, remember you have to remain inside the commanding sphere of the leader to have the chance to use uh, the support attack so yeah it's like this and then you just continue to use supporting fire Okay. In that case, we are not going to send out the second team. I think the second team is either going to deal with these two, or they are going to deal with the Ares force that is going to come for us. Yeah, and remember, this is the first turn, so I think we are doing great. Can we go back? No, we cannot. We're running a little low on uh, energy as well. Ooh. I'm gonna attack it. Oh, but we can. Oh, but we can. Oh, <laughs> do I got you? Do I got you? All right, tell me you got. Ah, uh, no. Ah, oh, god. Yeah, wrong choice. Wrong choice. Okay, okay, alright, alright. Yep, pass. Yeah, the Ares is going to charge right at us. Why well, they all go for our warship? Okay! I, I, I have no problem with that. I mean, the Gundam needs to focus on the, uh, on the mission, so... Turns. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Don't need to work on that. All right, just make sure it dies. Bam. All right, how best to do this? Oh uh, yeah. I think we need to, yeah. And then, yeah, once we, uh... Okay, now, so, remember, uh, the Death Sith has already used the, the final... No, 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 has reached the, the final uh, bonus step. So, instead of that, we just go up, wound this, so the Sand Rock can go up and destroy it. With that, we should be able to reach the last missiles very quickly. Yeah, I, I'm I'm glad I didn't uh, pick the hard <laughs> hard move for this one. Uh, would not end well. Yeah. Oh no, there is also one more. Yeah, I think we can get there. I think we can get there. Yeah, shouldn't be a problem. Should not be a problem. <laughs> or at least I hope. Alright, let's see. Uh... Alright, completely out of uh, energy. Alright, uh, go back, go back. Go back, go back, go back. Do we have any? No. 
Nothing is in range. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, lucky me. <laughs> oh, bam! Ah. Oh. Game is easier. <laughs> ah. No, we didn't reach it. No, 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 no. Uh, uh. All right, go back, recharge. Uh. Super high, you say. Can we kill it in one hit? No, not quite. Uh... Okay, alright. <laughs> I hate it. Bam. I was hoping maybe we can uh, bonus step and have the Phoenix Gundam charge forward, but... Okay, alright, alright, alright. Leaving the master behind is kinda... Oh. Anyway... Uh... Any reason we send them out? Uh, maybe. I won't send these out because uh, they only have 5 movement. Uh, the the battleship actually has six, so if we use the ship to springboard it, it is always faster to do it that way than to have the uh, have the mobilizers out in the open. So yeah, yeah. Also, we have to do this. Bam! Yeah, destroy. Yes, good. Alright, character level up. Yeah, thank you. How's your uh, energy holding up? Pretty good, I would say. <laughs> but I don't want to do it all my all on my own. Yeah, no. No thank you. Well, in that case, because they are going to reach us, I will send other team members here to maybe do some uh, defense support as well. So, yeah. Alright, last turn. Alright, counter attack. Uh, big rival, counter support. Support defend. This one. Confirm. Go. Ouch. Alright, do you sure now? I will hope so. Perfect. Well, give some support, I guess, because I want to shoot it down as well. Alright, alright, alright. Come on, come on. Okay. Ugh. Supporting attack is just ridiculously powerful. Reflexes, huh? We'll decide it later. Bam, super high. Alright, alright. Wow, they actually charge us. Alright. Uh, counter attack. No reason not to, I mean... Ooh, one shot kill. I love to see it. <laughs> oh ho 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 ho! Okay, okay, okay. Three turns, huh? Alright. Ah, boom. 
Well, luckily the missiles doesn't explode and do damage to the adjacent <laughs> side of it. Uh, that would be ugly. Uh... Does that kill it? Yes? No? No. Sad. <laughs> That's what it is, but... Crap. We need one more turn. We need one more turn. Uh, I hate it. We need one more turn. That's not cool. That's not cool at all. Alright, uh, move up, move up. And uh, Wing Gundam, I I'm not even sure what Hero is uh, doing right now. Uh, it's like... <laughs> yeah, they're, they're completely out of position. I, I mean, does that even work? Alright, let's see. Yeah, we might be able to do a good uh, link up attack. Oh, we have to think about it. Alright. Fling out a couple of guys out. I can ask for support. Oh. Okay. Alright, alright. Is there enough to uh, do it? It is! Excellent! Nice. Okay, so... Alright, let's see. Yeah, Phoenix Zero. Uh, send some more out, I guess. Yeah. One of the good things... Of us not actually uh, retrieving the uh, leader inside the battleship. Okay, get the ability. Sense awaken for sixty. Not for you, I think. <laughs> yeah, he is not an awakening character, so no. Can we do a link up attack? A nice link up attack? I mean. Only one, huh? Yeah, so what what's this about? Is that um with the link up attack we can uh have multiple lock on enemies and then just shoot them all at once. Uh we are going to use it a lot more in the late game, not so much uh, in the early game. Yeah. Eh. In that case, I actually should just yeah use common attack and then uh, continue to use supporting fire to uh, just <laughs> one shot kill everything that is in sight. Yeah, the enemies charging at us is very very welcome. I mean, not so if they actually get to take shot at us, but <laughs> it's what it is. Alright. Uh. XP gained by destroying an enemy plus 10% within the selected area. Last for one turn. Okay. Four scar. Minus. 30% uh, for selected unit. Okay, okay, alright, alright, alright. Uh, yeah, we wanted to kill them before we kill the last missile, I think. But the energy situation is not very good. Well, I mean, 
Alfred's team is looking pretty good. So yeah, I mean, yeah, we'll line up like that. That way, if they come to attack us, we get to counter attack. All right, yeah, that's what I'll do. And then uh, this team that has uh, energy depleted like <laughs> for, for one turn, one round of attack, and then they're just completely gone. Yeah, so yeah, let's let's get them back. Let's get them back. All right, let's go. All right, so we can do the counter attack. Uh, counter number two. Counter number three, I guess. Yeah, I'm not too concerned about the uh, HP right now. I don't think they can kill us in one hit, so we better make sure they get killed instead. So, yep, excellent. All right. So, in addition to that, uh, this game you only get experience on kills, not attacks. So it is very important to note that. Counter support, Lord Saber, counter, 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 yeah, go. <laughs> good. Wow, that's a lot of HP. Yeah, it might be a good idea to have uh, someone take the damage instead. Uh, at least the next attack, that is. Now, remember, this purple uh, tile uh, unit actually has a lot more experience than the than the usual ones, so... Oh, we're done with them! Huh, you're running out of time? No, I'm not. <laughs> oh, we are, we are, we are running out of time, but, but we're not. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, but uh, yeah. Uh, don't, don't get all worked up. We're not, we're not going to run out of time, what are you talking about? <laughs> okay. Uh, the Tornado Gundam, I really hate the Tornado Gundam, but alright. Well, no matter what I do, I'm not going to kill them in one hit, so... Let's do it this way. Ouch, that was a hefty attack. Alright. Some damage, some damage. Oh, you are hurt, go back. Alright. Phoenix Zero. Sorty. Beam Saber. Kill him, please. Alright, one hit. Nice. Another of the ability as well. Uh, strategies. Now, you see, uh, this is what we are looking for. So, yeah, woo! Alright! Okay, more level ups. That's always welcoming. Woo, super high, uh, so Alright, uh, Mega Beam Cannon, support, uh, Beam Rival, confirm. Alright, can we kill it? I think we can. There is no reason we cannot, right? <laughs> as long as we hit, that is. Ooh, that's a lot of damage as well. Yeah, I, I love using Eterna. Uh, Eterna actually shoots really well. So... And when she decides to shoot... Uh, 271 range to Jesus! <laughs> Yeah, she's gonna hit, yeah. When she decides to do that, she is gonna hit. It's just plain and simple. Uh, Alright, let's see. Do we continue to muck around or... Yeah, at least we destroy this one. Yeah, I think once we uh, clear out all the missiles, uh, then we, we will be... Jetting out, so all that is left behind. Uh, I don't think we are going to to mop up. 
Eh, whatever. It's just two, two of them. <laughs> kind of pointless. Okay, mission accomplished. Forgive me, Your Excellency. I failed to get rid of them. I think this is actually a little bit different from what happens in the uh, from the in the animation. Uh, because in in the animation, the missiles actually goes off, and some of them get out alive, and some of them, yeah, yeah, the the Gundams, of course, always get out alive. But then, yeah, the the base is completely obliterated. Huh? That's not like you at all. May I ask how exactly you chose to eliminate them? Attempt to destroy the base by activating the self-destruct sequence for the missiles stored there. And? <laughs> they elected to destroy the missiles? The explosion was prevented. Huh, they've saved us. Your Excellency? The Earth can only take so much. It wouldn't do to ruin it. We are pretty creatures, humans. Anyone can commit murder. We owe them thanks the next time we meet? <laughs> yes, Your Excellency. My lady, you have much to learn. Yes, Your Excellency, I will learn. Alright, alright. Yeah, maybe I remember wrong. Okay, stage clear. Yeah, bam. How about that? Yeah, Atana. <laughs> She's basically my sniper now, <laughs> but uh, yeah, carrying the team, huh? Yeah, alright, more caps always helpful, but... First clear secret. We're missing one. What? Alright. Uh, you get information. Alright. Advance the armor. Yeah, this is the... Uh, spare parts for the for the mobilities and things like that. Defense plus six. Yeah. Okay. All right. So it's a fun <laughs> it's a fun little mission here, and uh, yeah. Let's take a look at our team first. Uh, no, not the dispatch the team, of course. Uh. Yeah, any one of them can develop into something that is meaningful. No, probably not. <laughs> Level 6 or 7, huh? That's a hefty <laughs> chunk of XP to reach. Uh, no, maybe not. Yeah, the... Uh, yeah, the, the development is a little bit slow. I, I heard about this uh, before I actually bought this game, is that the uh, develop... Uh, when the development progress was greatly slowed down in this game because they don't have as many uh, variety of mobility suits uh, compared to the previous game because in the previous game uh, we have the UC era so for those who don't understand what is the UC era is the Gundam where the most popular is of course Amuro Ray and then also Seta Gundam uh, Kamio Bidan and uh, also Double Seta and then finally the new Gundam series where uh, it comes back to Amuro Ray those are the UC uh, part of the of the Gundam history and they have a lot of uh, uh, outside or other uh, other side of the story where they have a lot of uh, I, I don't remember the name but they have a lot of uh, different mobilizers they, they're basically mass produ production units but then they also have a lot of uh, unique units that uh, they can add to the game uh, however, because in, in Gundam Wing, uh, they only have like G unit and then uh, for Seed, they only have a stray and then for for um, uh, for for double O, they, they don't have a lot of variety in the uh, in the mobile suits uh, variety uh, uh, com 
<laughs> uh, apartment. So that's why they slowed it down to sort of try to elongate the playability of the game, which is ridiculous. I mean, we've already bought the game. <laughs> but uh, whatever, uh, we'll, we'll get there, don't worry. Uh, like here is already level 4 already, which is always good. I think this one is actually gonna win. <laughs> it would be funny if they actually give us Gundam Wing. Uh, in previous games, you you usually don't develop uh, Phoenix Zero, this kind of uh, original uh, uh, mobility suits into uh, the into some of the units that are inside the actual series. But I think they changed it. I think they changed it. Well, we'll soon find out <laughs> in the next episode, maybe. Yeah, so, um, yeah, it's always fun. And then we also have uh, some, yeah, leveled up uh, characters as well. Uh, they're not very, very much developed. Uh, look at that. Oh my god, they're still level one. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, uh, it's hard to level up uh, uh, at, at the start of the game. But once you get like a good group of uh, captain, a good group of uh, operators basically for, for the whole uh, battleship and then you get some very good pilots then it doesn't matter what, what you encounter, they just obliterate everything. <laughs> but before that, but before that, <laughs> you see things like uh, uh, a, a Phoenix Zero going from 10,000 to 2,000 <laughs> in a couple of attacks and then you just have to uh, buck out of there or something like that. But yeah. That is what uh, this is what's going to happen, and also the group dispatch. I don't think it is completed. We can actually speed it up, right? No, we're not going to spend resources to speed it up. Yeah, no, that that is not necessary. Uh, I think I will be trying to uh, complete some of these. Uh, you can see here. Whoa. Yeah, you can see a recommended composition is that character with uh, strategist ability and then there is also this one with uh, charismatic ability. So yeah, I will be um, arranging two groups to complete these two uh, uh, dispatch missions as well because they are kind of uh, related to the Gundam Wing story as well. Uh, so while it is not very impactful, it is still um, on theme <laughs> with the current uh, progress that we are going on and also uh, that we might be able to get some uh, uh, some uh, great rewards like uh, I think with the Gundam, War, uh, Gundam Head uh, right there, it means that you can get some units and some experience uh, through this uh, mission and then also this one uh, not only can you get some new units you might also be able to get some spare parts as well to upgrade maybe your warship uh, on top of your uh, mobility suits as well so it is very very important that we try to complete it as soon as possible because uh, you can't always build it up using the uh, using the items that you get however uh, you still want to get them, and uh, yeah, the one thing that I don't think this is a good idea, the one thing is that it actually messes up the game economy balance. And what I mean is that uh, if you continue to play the game without any dispatch, then you don't obviously you don't get the experience and you, you don't get the uh, extra materials. However, if you, if you do get those, uh, because uh, across time you you just spend, uh, uh, you just send out more and more dispatch team, and then and then they just gain ridiculous amount of experience, like this ten thousand experience. It's like a single stage doesn't give you that much experience. So uh, while it is like two hundred, uh, uh, two and a half hours of time, you you don't have to actually do anything. And it's kind of like, kind of gamey, so to speak, and also uh, that you suddenly are gaining uh, experience without actually progressing the game. And that could be a problem, because then suddenly you, you might be able to get like a Gundam double O, uh, double o Riser, and then you are you're still chopping up like Leos and stuff. <laughs> Which is uh, a little bit weird, of course you can always tune it to like um, 
uh, hard or even extra, but then it it just significantly inflates the game and causes the pace of the game to become even more unbalanced. So I, I'm not sure. I try. I will try not to overdo the dispatch. That's what I will try to do. But uh, yeah, I will send them out. Uh, I'll, I'll try out this. Uh, try out this feature and uh, also once they are completed like three hours yeah we can do this like two hundred two and a half hour and then a three hour and I'll be stop playing for a while uh, after three hours I'll come back and then I'll maybe make another episode uh, and then I can also uh, report to you how, how I feel about the dispatch <laughs> uh, the, the, this dispatch feature a little bit more so uh, also, uh, if you are a Ganon fan, do, do let us know uh, how, how you feel about this game and uh, uh, and how how we are doing. And if there is there are any recommendations where uh, maybe we wanted to, you wanted to talk about more about uh, the Gundams or more about the characters or something, uh, do leave us a comment. Uh, and uh, we're trying to have community here. I know the there is not a lot of Gundam fans especially in the English speaking community but uh, it's still something that I really love and uh, yeah I, and if you are also one of the Gundam fans as well yeah it's nice to meet you <laughs> yeah it's always happy to you know have a community like this and uh, you to make it possible so yeah I mean uh, this is going to be fun and I hope that you also enjoy the game uh, enjoy the gameplay and also the, my video uh, as much as I do uh, when I'm working on it as well. Uh, you can see that I'm very excited about this. Um, so re remember that I, I also did a Reason 2 series uh, uh, towards the back uh, uh, to, to the uh, ending half of the game. I was not as uh, enjoying the game as much as I do, but for G generation, I think I will enjoy it all the way through. So I hope that I <laughs> that actually makes it a little bit more enjoyable on your side as well. And uh, yeah, so do leave us a comment, see see what you think. Uh, and for the meantime, thank you for watching. I'm Brian, and I'll be seeing you in the next video. Goodbye.